Hello everyone. Today we are playing some more Undertale Last Corridor. And it appears this Sans is trying to be clever. I don't appreciate him trying to be clever because it means he's trying to win. Thankfully he's misplaying a fair amount. And also, I'm gonna do something. Uh, I'm not sure if it's gonna work out, but I'm gonna start trying to essentially make a, I think the term is backlog of content. So I've already have, I believe, five videos that will be uploaded in the future, being Portal, a Portal um, one particular, that's gonna be uploaded one per Saturday until I reach the end. I'm thinking I'm kind of... I don't know, maybe I can win. He just burned a Mega Force. I was skeptical about winning until he used Mega Force. Now, okay, this is real close. This is so close. <gasps> okay, wow. Really close one. I'm gonna give him the GG. Okay. This time we got some Sans gameplay. Anyway, also the game I'll be playing called Rampage Nights. I already have one scheduled and recorded. It uh, will be next month, I believe May the 1st. If I record more Rampage Nights, I'll probably do or just schedule them one time for each month. I'm Doing that, I'll probably throw them on the first. Presumably, if you don't see one on the first of a month, it means I'm not doing them anymore. I'm not quite sure how long I'll even be recording these videos. I've always wanted to just kind of record YouTube videos, and this is kind of my best chance to try to get into it. Again, not sure if I'm going to stay in it. Might burn out, lose interest or something, but... If any of you subscribe, you can see how long I last. Looks like we're facing Dust Tail this time. This is the person that nearly beat me last round, so gotta respect him and not try anything too dumb. I gotta play like he might actually beat me. Now, if you wanna have fun in this game, play needlessly aggressively against everyone and only play well if they play well. If you want to win all the time, play needlessly, meticulously careful, even against people who are blatantly not using their characters, right? So you will certainly get more wins because you won't make dumb mistakes like I do pretty often. Well, it's not too often. Usually, if someone has high wins, you can respect them. If someone has low wins, you can get away with disrespecting them. Unfortunately, this guy doesn't seem to be a dust main, so he's having a little trouble with the attacks. Ooh, nearly. Oh, ooh, ooh. he's fig he's getting better. It's getting better. But I think I win now. Finishing move! Oh, wow. Yo. These are so close. GG. Alright, I'll bring you back when we have... Oh wait, I'm gonna be soon. So we're gonna be back pretty soon. Okay. A few seconds have gone by and we have someone with 230 wins in our game. Unfortunately... <laughs> The guy doesn't really rival my Sans too. Oh, he left! I'm actually kind of upset that he left. I was really enjoying facing him. One thing about Sans is because having uh, more wins than someone on a Sans character doesn't give you any advantage. It means that if you beat someone, or if you do better than someone else with Sans, you're truly better than them. This person is super lagging.
Alright. Anyway, I'll be back when I have something to show. Okay, we're back. And that was a short one. Okay. Let's try to get a direct shot. Miss, unfortunately. Okay, we got one kill on someone who was being pretty aggro. Let's kill the person typing. Oh, he finished typing, unfortunately. 